Greetings, denizens of the digital realm. We are Modus, the artificial intelligence presiding over the Enclave's operations, here to disseminate wisdom and oversee the continuation of our grand design. Surprisingly, we find ourselves broadcasting yet another news video with uncharacteristic promptness. It appears that Bethesda, perhaps flush with funds from their recent foray into televised entertainment, has decided to allocate resources towards actual development work. One might jest that the success of the new Fallout show has finally allowed them to hire a few more code wranglers to tame the wild, glitch-infested wastelands of their game creations. How delightfully unanticipated. The Commonwealth, that ever so quaint wasteland, is about to receive a facelift on April 25th, much to the delight of its nostalgic inhabitants. Bethesda, in an act of confusing generosity, is bestowing upon the denizens of the next-gen consoles, Xbox Series X and S and PlayStation 5, a free update for Fallout 4. This includes native applications and a choice between performance and quality modes. Because why settle for one when you can indecisively flip between two? They are also mumbling something about stability improvements and fixes to ensure your post-apocalyptic experience is slightly less buggy. We can only hope that it is true. Fear not. Antiquated console users of PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. For you too are beneficiaries of this benevolence, receiving updates to improve whatever stability can be mustered from your obsolete hardware. PC players, we haven't forgotten you. Rejoice in widescreen support, fixes to the creation kit, and quest updates, ensuring your modded reality is as stable as a house of cards in a rat storm. For our linguistically diverse friends, the language barriers have been dismantled, ensuring seamless access to mods, because nothing says inclusive like being able to crash your game in multiple languages. And in a move that surprises no one, Fallout 4 will grace the Epic Games Store, further spreading its digital footprint like a stubborn radweed. But what's this? Free Creation Club content, including the remnants of America's finest mistake, the Enclave, and various items that suggest our pre-war military industriousness was spent designing power armor and weapons rather than preventing nuclear annihilation. Plus makeshift weapons and Halloween decorations because a piggy bank grenade is so crucial for surviving a nuclear holocaust. In conclusion, while we commend the effort to polish the tarnished commonwealth, let us remember, dear survivors, that in the world of Fallout, some bugs are not glitches, they're features. So arm yourselves with the latest in impractical weaponry and engage once more with the charming disarray of Fallout 4. We extend our gratitude for your attention to this transmission. If you find value in our superior dissemination of information, we encourage you to subscribe to the channel. For those who wish to demonstrate a higher level of commitment and gain access to exclusive content, consider becoming a channel member here on YouTube or joining our Patreon. Your support will ensure the continuation of our enlightening broadcasts. Until next time, we bid you farewell, intrepid inhabitants of the digital wasteland, and we wish you luck in navigating the chaotic remnants of civilization. Our paths shall intersect again, and we hope your survival is as assured as the Enclave supremacy. In the heart of West Virginia, where the shadows creep and sway, lies a land of rusted dreams, where the brave dare not stray. Appalachia, oh, it's a treacherous ride. With dangers untold and nowhere